welcome to my channel learn and earn to live your life on your own terms one you're welcome to my channel learn and earn academy and today in this video we are going to talk about the way digital payment in india has progressed india has crossed 400 million transactions through upi unified payment interface launched by national payment corporation of india we all remember the day when the demonetization was announced by our honorable prime minister shri narendra modi and what havoc it caused to the lives of the normal people and at the end of the day all the money that was believed to be black money has already been back to the system but eventually one thing a silver lining which happened during the course of demonetization was India moved towards digital payment and unified payment interface is one of the milestones which has which India has achieved in making India a digital economy which is certainly going to have a lot of benefits in this video we are going to talk about the great achievement of India to have achieved 400 million transactions through UPI so if you like this video you can press the like button you can subscribe to my channel and you can also share this video on social media please help us to spread education in this beautiful world now UPI transactions cross 400 million mark in September which shows a growth of over 30 percent now in a country where still 50 percent more than 50 percent of the population lives in rural areas for a country to move towards digital economy to make transactions online through mobile interface is a great achievement now monthly transactions through the unified payment interface crossed 400 million mark for the first time in september it's a data released by national payment corporation of india it is the implementing agency for the upi transactions and all the digital transactions which happen in our country 405.87 million upi transactions amounting to 59835.36 crores was carried out during september that's a 30 percent jump over the transactions which happened in august which is a huge amount now this has been launched by many of the payment service providers the prime being the payment paytm app which is powered by Beam UPI. So you can link any bank account with Paytm and pay directly to anyone using UPI. You will get a unique ID for yourself, which you need to remember and tell people if they want to do transactions with you. Now, Paytm said that it has powered 137 million of these transactions at 33% market share. So if you talk about the most dominant player in digital uh, economy who carries out digital transactions on its platform, it is Paytm. It added that more than 20% of all payments on Paytm were used using Bheem UPI. It's been launched by Government of India, Ministry of Finance. Deepak Abbott, Senior Vice President at Paytm said, it's encouraging to see the widespread adoption of Paytm Bheem UPI as it's fast becoming a preferred payment method. In fact, Paytm was the only source where you could make payments during the time of demonetization because all the ATMs did not have cash. So it was quite helpful at that time. So as per Paytm, they will continue to invest their efforts to introduce more consumers and merchants to the convenience of Paytm UPI for online and offline users. Now, NPCI also stated that IMPS transactions in the country grew marginally to 135.74 million in September. Just month, uh, just last month, NPCI released UPI 2.0, the upgraded version of Unified Payment Interface which I'm sure we all must be using if you make transactions through UPI. So personally, I do make transactions through UPI and the app which I use is phone pay app, which is very handy, affordable 
at the same time very convenient there is no transaction fees plus you get a lot of cashbacks as well however I also use Paytm New release allowed users, merchants to link their overdraft accounts to UPI, enabling them to continue withdrawing money even if the account did not have sufficient funds. So this is a great benefit and I'm sure India is moving towards a, a better future of an integrated and a digital economy. This is going to certainly reduce corruption and improve the efficiency of getting economic transactions done in our country. So if you like this video, you can press the like button, you can subscribe to my channel and you can also share this on social media. Please help us to spread education in this beautiful world. Thank you. Have a great day. If you like my video, please like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel by pressing the bell icon.